Welcome back to R&DW's Adventures, another junk fooding edition with a haul still from that other Asian market that we gave a shot to. <laughs> I'm Daryl. And I'm Renee. And these were kind of inspired by another uh, YouTube channel that we follow, Ordinary Adventures. They got some uh, Japanese junk food and tried it on air. Uh, so these are actually different from what they tried. Similar, but different ones. Yeah, and these are actually Korean. They're not, Korean? they're not Japanese, okay. they're Korean. So uh, we're recording this April 26th. We're still on lockdown when, actually we're just out of lockdown, hopefully when you guys see this, because oh, this is yes. gonna premiere May 18th. And as of now, we're on lockdown through the 15th. Hopefully it'll end on the 15th. So hopefully we've yeah. had three days, or two days, of being allowed out of the house. But today we're gonna try these <laughs> little squeegee things. Uh, the little penguin is this uh, Holodo guy that uh, is cute. on these packages. And then this one's totally different, but we figured we'll bundle them all together because they're all these squeegees. Squeezy. So we've got an orange, a, uh, an, an apple. apple, and a sweet potato to try. And the translation on these things is really bizarre. I'll try to drop in the video for that <laughs> here so you can kind of see what we're talking about. But this one is actually possibly to be served warm in the microwave, out of the microwave. Because it's sweet potato. It is sweet potato. So it's supposed to be, I think, like a sweet potato like, soup. It's probably good as long as it's not cold. Well, it, it could be chilled. That's true. You know, there's a lot of the uh, chilled soup, so maybe it would be good. So I figure we'll start with the uh, apple. Okay. We don't know if it's a jelly or if it's like a boba type thing or like a like well, an apple sauce. There's a thing. Uh, reference to rice on one of these that I saw. It's liquid. So, give it a suck. <laughs> it's actually good. It's got a weird, fakey orange taste. Maybe it needs to be shaken a little. Maybe, but I don't think so. I th I think it's uh, it tastes it's like just tang. an orange <laughs> drink. It is really good though. Mm -hmm. Better than I expected. Definitely a kid's style drink. Yes, for sure. But you know, good keep in the car or pack quickly kind of drink. Yeah, I, I would probably go for this again as a uh, uh, emergency thing. Uh, I don't remember if we actually saw what the calorie count on these were, <laughs> but I could see this. Yeah, it kind of has that taste of like a uh, uh, energy shot kind of thing. Kind of. That's what, well, that's what Tang reminds me of, or the yeah. energy drinks remind so me of So I'm Tang. thinking maybe it's something like that, but I, well, I'm going to give kids, it a three. Yeah. I would give it a three. It's a lot better than I expected it to be because orange can be really good or really nasty. Yeah, this is liquid again as well, the okay. apple. I'm going to assume this is just an apple juice. I hope it's as good as good an apple as mm, this. Mm -mm. No, it's not good. It's a jelly. I was going to say like an apple sauce, but it's got kind of that perfumey apple to it, hmm. but I think it's pretty good. Oh, I like this. I, I'm, oh, going to, I'm going to say it's, it's not as good. It's more liquid, but it's like a liquid. Here, look. You can't see <laughs> You're it. You're not going to see it's it. It's like a liquid jelly. Yeah. Oh, do that. It's a gel. Are these expensive? Uh, they're not cheap. Oh, I like this one. I'm going to give this one a four and a half. Well, wow. I'm going to give it a three and a half. I like it. I do like it, but not that much. I would actually... I want to say these are about $2 a piece. It had like a symbol on here that I need to have at work. I'd totally take it there. <laughs> but I can't. All right. And now for the uh, possibly dangerous one. Sweet potato. Which sometimes in the U.S. at least has turmeric, which unfortunately Renee can't have. That's disgusting, but I don't think there's turmeric in it. <laughs> I'm going to be very, ew. I don't think there is, because usually turmeric is for color. Yeah, and it's, it <laughs> it's has <laughs> a nasty color, too. Uh, it if tastes you like, like baby food. Yeah, if you like potato soup, no, this would probably be good warmed. Oh, maybe. But I like potato soup. That reminds me of baby no, food. It is not good. And yes, I've had baby food. After I had surgery, I had to... <laughs> Eat this baby food and it only lasted two days. My mom bought me all this baby food. 
<laughs> and I'm like, it's gross. I can't eat it. She's like, okay. I did, apparently didn't like it when I was a baby either, so. All right. So that's going to do it for this episode of uh, Junk Fooding. The the two fruit ones, uh, not bad. That I would uh, definitely look at going again. Mm -hmm. But the potato, sweet potato, so maybe we tr we should try heating it up and try it again. We'll let you know maybe later. Yeah, no, <laughs> we'll, I don't We'll add so. something in the comments if well, we are brave. Especially since it's opened, I don't think I want to try uh, uh, microwaving it. Can this go in the microwave? I don't know. I mean, this the doesn't thing seem is like it should go in the microwave. microwave. <laughs> Okay, we'll see. Uh, yeah, just <laughs> we might let you know. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thanks again for watching. Make sure to click on the uh, subscribe icon over here so that you can be notified of all of our new videos, including hopefully some of the ones that are going to be live in the future and some that aren't junk fooding. Great. But if you like the junk fooding, make sure to click this link over here because that's going to get you to all of our uh, junk fooding videos, including some old ones. And if you haven't checked out the latest ones, there's plenty more there. Yes, there is.